मेरा बच्चा एक दस साल का है एक बेटी मेरी पाँच साल की है क्या पढ़ रहे हैं उसमें तीन साल के बाद मैं प्रेग्नेंट हुई मुझे जरूरत नहीं थी इसलिए मैंने अबोशन करवाया पहले तो जड़ी बूटी से भी बच्चा गिर जाता रहा है थोड़ी से कहीं हल्दी खा ले मीठा सोडा पानी में खौला के खा ले दर्द से तड़पती रहे Abortion is actually very real need of women, and if it is not done in a proper way, in a safe way, it can cause a lot of mortality and morbidity in the women. At that point in time, we had an abortion law for a long time, but. Something was not moving, and there were a lot of asks of making abortions more accessible and safe. IPAS Development Foundation really look at what has happened to abortion services since legalization and what could be done. That was the starting point. Women needing abortion do not just need a provider and the technology for offering services but they get the abortion services in a complex ecosystem the woman is in the center but around her is the family the community public and private health system that delivers the care and the policy and the legal environment that impacts all these so when we call abortion ecosystem our work we realize will only be successful when we address each element of the ecosystem the ips operations in the country uh, started uh, late 2001 women should be the center and everything which she needs for herself uh, should be the key which should be available at the facilities we can't force the women to carry on the pregnancy so under these circumstances comprehensive abortion care came in where we took this abortion services literally to the doorstep of the uh, women we have to keep the woman at the center see whether she has access to those services her choices are limited so her decision making is involved into this access and along with that decision making access availability cost we should also see that entire process is quality driven prince abortion care is about uh, women getting quality services that is provided by our uh, trained providers our main focus to train the medical officers mbbs doctors doctors as well as nurses used to come over and uh, they used to get uh, proper training for 12 days they get the theory sessions and the practical and they are able to do the cases uh, uh, voluntarily under the guidance of the trainer Excellent. there are some uh, classes like abortion scenario and uh, clinical assessment how they assess and counseling that is one session and uh, after that post abortion contraception so yen martira you will take the gender important the main thing of this comprehensive abortion case is the manual vacuum aspiration the, the special instrument what we are using valve is made up of latex this is the two buttons valve is made the biggest advantage of uh, mva is that it is manually operated so in places in the remote areas where there is no electricity there also mva can be done in 2002 medication abortion was approved for use in india we had two very simple basic technologies mva and simultaneously medication abortion and we anyone who worked with abortion particularly ipas realized was that medication abortion was the way forward if you wanted to reach women we also realized that awareness is a big challenge you may have a provider who is ready to provide services but if women do not know safe abortion is available here or if safe abortion is legal 
they will fail to use the service. Asha workers, Anganwadi workers, all are trained to give awareness to the public because they are the basic field care staff. So that has helped in training them so that they are going to bridge between the health facility and the community. आन चाह घर ठहर जाता है उसके लिए गांव में लोग सोचता था कि घर पर नहीं कराना चाहिए लोग सुनेगा तो शिकायत करेगा हम लोग भी डरते थे कि कहीं कराएंगे पकड़ा जाएंगे हम लोग समझते थे कि गर्भपात कानूनन जुर्म है जब ट्रेनिंग बीएससी में मिला था तो बताया गया था कि गर्भपात किस कारण से कराना चाहिए जब आई पास का ट्रेनिंग मिल गया तो हम लोग भी माने खुला बात कर सकते हैं महिला से तो ठीक है सर जदि गर्भपात करबो बिसारी सा जिमान खुनकाले पारा मोर लगत उलाबा मय तुमा लोग डॉक्टर ओसर लई जान सुंदर भाबे गर्भपात कराई लई है आशा बैठो लोए करना फिर तब सिविल लोग गोई करने तो त्यार डॉक्टर्स लोए करने गोई करना तो त्यार रूमों तो लोगों सामा तो त्यार मो वाश करा सो तो त्यार मो कुनो अखुबिदा ना आसले ब्लीडिंग उस जो आना को बिखो आता तो ना आसले उसने ऐसा कर दिया कि मुझे पता ही नहीं चला थोड़ा सा बस दर्द हुआ बस इसके बाद मुझे बहुत आराम लगा आवारसन के बाद उनको ये दे देते हैं किसको पढ़ लेना कोई प्रॉब्लम होगी तो हमको बताना फिर आ करके पहले काउंसलिंग नहीं करते थे ट्रेनिंग के बाद काउंसलिंग अलग करने लगे अलग रूम में बुला के Actually before the training we didn't handle any case, such cases we used to send the cases to the higher institutions. ट्रेनिंग लेने के बाद में वही महिला यदि हमारे पास में आई हैं इस तरह से तो उनको हमने बकायदे सुविधा दी है और उस समय ये लग रहा था कि हाँ पहले इतनी परेशानी जाती थी और अब हम उनको ये सुविधाएं दे पा रहे हैं आई डी एफ विजिट द सेंटर्स एंड दे गिव द फीडबैक आउ दे आर परफॉर्मिंग आर दे आर परफॉर्मिंग नॉर्मली आर एनी डिफिकल्टीज इज देर IDF uh, really they are facilitating uh, regarding the logistics, and uh, they have provided consultants so that uh, they will coordinate with the state, uh, I mean district nodal officers for the CAC services. For abortion services, IDF has been our partner for quite some time, especially for developing various technical guidelines, so that technical assistance we get from them. In rural India, a large number of women do not have a choice of going to the private doctors. What can we do about that? In Bihar, the Yukti Yojana program was born. It's a public-private partnership of accrediting private facilities to provide abortion services, but free of cost. This program has ये बेनिफिट हुआ कि कोई पेशेंट जो है इकोनॉमिकल पर्पस से सफर होती थी तो उन लोगों को हम लोगों ने फ्री सर्विस दिया थ्रू युक्ति योजना यू कैन से दैट वी हैव ऑलरेडी स्टैब्लिश 107 सेवन फैसिलिटीज ऑल ओवर बिहार एंड वन लैख फिफ्टी फाइव थाउजेंड वीमेन हैव ऑलरेडी टेकन दिस एडवांटेज ऑफ दिस फैसिलिटी With IDF, we've seen an evolution in IDF's own approaches, in its own thinking, in its own innovations that they have brought um, to the field, and that is really crucial because, as an organization that really leads the field in India, I think it occupies a place, pride of place, with respect to a partnership with government. Our partnership with 11 state governments has led to the creation of. 100 plus 
CAC training centers within the public health system, which during these years have led to about 12,000 providers, most of them new providers, first time abortion providers, and they in turn have gone on to offer services to 2 million women. Comprehensive abortion services and IPAS for us are like synonymous because the whatever policy we developed at Government of India level, when it comes to implementation, when giving trainings to service provider, partnering with the state governments and seeing the implementation happening in the states along with capacity building and also logistics and essentials being in place. IPAS has played a very important role. It has become more women-centric, looking into the needs of the women, and uh, just from having a clinical procedure, it has evolved into a service to women uh, with uh, care, compassion, contraceptives, and counseling. We work together. IPAS is a foundation. It's a, uh, they are with us. They work as a partner. So our policies are implemented both by NHM and also IPAS. IDF, the government of India and the other stakeholders have played an important role, a crucial role even, in making sure that women now have more choices than they ever had in the history of our country. It's not going to stop just at the 11 states, it's going to be a widespread uh, sort of a wave which will get all the states to get their services converted into a comprehensive care and then uh, it will be sustainable and will carry on its own. We don't need to be there everywhere. All the public health facilities up to the primary health center should be providing comprehensive abortion care services. Abortion should be available to all women with safety, with dignity, with compassion and with respect whenever they need, wherever they need, for whichever gestation they need. <laughs>